Hi, family, Christina Rea, back with another video. I'm about to break it down. I'm about to break it down. They want to literally consume us. Hello, Illuminati, with your stolen light and stolen soul fragments, stolen souls, human sacrifices. ancient wisdom so they're basically <laughs> stealing our light and um, like soul fragments stuff like that and putting it into a machine and creating basically like a god an artificial god is what they're creating they're putting all this stashing it into a machine and using humans, I mean all life, all life's light, even animals, for to consume as their own, so they can become like gods. They want to be the gods, but they're they can't because they're cut off from source. So they found a way to manipulate and and do it. This is where the fallen angels come in, where I think they become more of a mechanical uh, being. Um, you know, I think they're even mentioned in Gnostic texts a lot, known as the lords of karma, the rulers of this world, the archons, who are a parasitical being that are basically hackers. They hack into everything, the minds, our minds, yada, yada, yada. But the all-seeing eye, so you basically got yourself an artificial god. They use our light, consume our energy, drain us like vampires, to store it in a machine, an AI, a supercomputer. They store it all. They store consciousness they store you know ideas thoughts our light our energy they take it from us take our spiritual gifts and claim it as their own and then try to use it to control the world they basically want to mirror God and create a world using us. And reflecting God's idea in an artificial synthetic manner, a synthetic way of reflecting God and all of his creations. They manipulate genetics, DNA, and mimic like, you know, we got GMOs, even our food. You know, they want to mimic what is organic of nature and grow different breeds of what is of God, what God created. They want to mimic it. And they even do it with animals and create new breeds. I mean, it just goes on and on and on. You know, they have all these scientists that are testing on animals and you know, this is what this is the kind of behavior they condone and humanity is not woken enough to that yet you know it's really really sad but this is what we're dealing with we're dealing with um, want to be gods who want to be us envy us um, want to consume us to use our own energy and light for themselves so they can be like gods, but they're not. They're not gods at all. They sit on a throne of lies. <laughs> and, but they get mad at us <laughs> for being who we are, but they want to be us. They want to be every single one of us. So, I hope that helps you guys. You know, these guys are uh, twisted.
very twisted. Um, people are starting to see their true colors and who they really are. You know, all this human sacrifice and stuff like that. They're just, it's just disgusting how long they've gotten away with these crimes and I just feel like God is saying no more that there will be I feel God keeps telling me there will be no more human sacrificing uh, that they are getting wiped out completely they can orchestrate all their agendas all they want to but we all read the story and we know how it ends we know how it ends so I love you guys. Stay strong on the battlefield. Don't give up. Protect your light energy. Don't let them take it from you. Don't even waste your energy on them. I love you guys.